Oh my goodness. It is raining so hard. And today is a naturalization ceremony for my dear friend who is becoming a US citizen. And I'm not missing this, so I need to go find an umbrella right now. I'm under the umbrella. Or as Jack likes to say, your umbrella. It's really beautiful. Even as I'm walking across the lawn, I can see that everyone's lining up. And even though it's this wild day of rain, people are dressed up. Please raise your right hand and repeat after me. I, I hereby declare an oath when you vote, you're expressing your views of how this country should be run, what our laws should be, and how our public money should be spent. And your vote can directly affect important questions. So that was beautiful. It was incredibly moving to see 125 people and to just imagine the history that shaped them in all of their countries. There was over 70 countries represented. And what brought them to this day to come together and take this oath and become citizens of the United States. And I have to share that I felt conflicted about attending the ceremony today. And I felt um, that complex kind of layering of what this could mean and how so many people want to go through this process right now and um, aren't being able to. So for me, it brought me to a place of when I've put someone on a pedestal in the past and they have fallen down you know, from that pillar and maybe it's really disappointing and maybe it's heartbreaking. And in those moments when someone falls off that pedestal, it's always brought me to a place of my inner resources and my inner truth rather than looking to them as my source. Um, it allows me to go within and find that power within. Uh, and just as the process of citizenship is in a really complex moment in our history, I see every individual going within and finding their inner resources and their power and their truth. And in that way, it's really inspiring and kind of reframing the process for me. And that's what I was celebrating today. All of these individuals finding their inner strength and their journey to achieve this goal, to reach this milestone. Um, so I'm very moved and very grateful. Congratulations, everyone.